the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's PSG, they take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, it could be on for him here. It's still alive. And a tidy tackle. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. that free kick but the goalkeeper had it covered all the way now what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position Tempele oh great defending high pressing at its best Well, sometimes a player is simply a natural talent. Ousmane Dembele falls in that category. Stuart, what do you... Well, the referee left with no alternative. Compelled to stop play. Things going again with a drop ball. Well, the foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. And Bellingham. Now with Modric. And it has arrived! The opening statement in this UEFA Champions League final. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Well, he has to get his team playing again. This isn't going to plan. Underway once more, and it's going to be interesting to see whether or not PSG can articulate an appropriate reply. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Might be a chance to break. No foul. PSG advantage. Now, can they take advantage? No let up here. The cut back. Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. Modric, strong but fair tackle. Now PSG moving the ball forward, what can they do from here? Incisive pass, effort from long distance, and he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Well, you've got to say, comfortably off target, Stuart. Yeah, that's a waste of good possession. His teammates are not happy with him, and they're letting him know.
the ball back with Real now really good build up but no end product Fabian PSG looking dangerous this could level it can they put it away and no nonsense defensive clearance oh, tremendous vision Rodrigo long range effort well it takes confidence to try your luck from that sort of distance well I have to say that was a really good effort he struck it so cleanly Good bit of closing down. Toro Muani. Warren Zaire Emery. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And out of play for a Paris Saint-Germain throw-in. Crossing possibilities. Can he get the level? The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. He's having quite the game for himself. Save after save after save. There will be one minute added on at the end. It's a well-struck pass. Mbappe. Mbappe tries his luck. Nicely saved. Short corner it is. And the referee's whistle. That will conclude the first half here at Wembley. The ball moving again. Real have the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Able to skip past his man. And blocked. Out of play. Real Madrid throw here. Nuno Mens. And Real Madrid have the ball again. Good ball over the top. Mbappe tries his luck. And a fine stop. Good bit of defending. Mbappe. Mbappe tries his luck. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, let's take another look because this is a special goal. He's so far out when he strikes it. He couldn't have hit that any better. Well, that's just what Ancelotti wanted. He has to be happy with this performance from his team. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Hakimi. Warren Zaire Emery. And PSG pushing forward with options available. Well, the supporters think it's on. Palmed away by the keeper. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. A goal! Just what they needed! Still plenty of life in this match!
Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So back underway. The arithmetic having been altered by PSG. And beating the defender. And PSG will have a throw in. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Fabian. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Mbappe tries his luck. Well, we gave it the big build up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Making progress is Kylian Mbappe, and narrowly off target here. Well, it's still all to play for, but that was a good effort, wasn't it? Substitution it is for PSG. Hakimi. 20 minutes to go in this one. Now with Hakimi. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Having to shoot. And no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Dembele. Dembele. Oh, managing to beat him. The delivery from Dembele. It comes to nothing in the end. Oh, in with a chance. The net is staring him in the face. Oh, dear, oh, dear. The goal was at his mercy. Tame effort. Marco Asensio. Kono Muani. Time is against PSG, but they still have the ability to hit back. Can he put it in? Oh, I can't believe it! Twists and turns in the closing stages. And it's anyone's guess who's going to lift the trophy. Incredible! Again, and no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger, otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. Well, Ancelotti can't hide his emotions, can he? That could be a big turning point in the game. So, underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. If Real Madrid could come up with a winner at this stage, it could be decisive. Well, able to close down the short. Hakimi. Now the defenders know they need to get tighter. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes, but this is not over and two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. Substitution for the hosts. Off the well, back underway here, and it's quite simple. Both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes.
spot on with that challenge. And support available. And they need to get tighter, but timely defending when it mattered. Rodrigo. And he's made headway. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. Well, he can't control his delight, can he? It's a wonderful moment for his team. Underway again, and we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. Room to roam for PSG on the wing, but the danger averted for now. Kangin Lee. A glorious chance. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such bedding. Great goal. Well, that picture says it all. His team are back in the game now. Back underway and quite the story being written in this one. Three all. Half time in extra time. And still they are level. And so, 15 more minutes. We're into the second period of extra time here. Outdoing his opponent. Our defensive resilience in the end, that's all that matters. Toro Muani. Oh, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Can they use it to their advantage? Marco Asensio away from the touchline here. And it went sailing over the crossbar. Not a moment he'll want to remember. Federico Valverde. Interception to snuff out the danger. And level as is, in the closing moments, can Real Madrid change that? Luka Modric. It's there for him. Oh, a breathless moment. Real Madrid take the lead in the Champions League final with time running out. Well, let's have another look at this because Modric shows great skill to go beyond the defender. And that's the perfect strike from Modric. He hits it with such power and accuracy. That's a brilliant goal. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! 
Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. <laughs> the Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Well, the celebrations are ongoing. I don't think they're going to be brought to an end anytime soon as they savour the moment with their supporters. And they've certainly played their part, the fans. They deserve to be involved with these celebrations. They've made so much noise here. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.